Lawmakers resume plenary for the last sitting of the week on Thursday. The Joint Committee reports on Judiciary and Narcotics on the NDLEA Act Amendment B 2024 was presented for consideration and adoption. As the word involved conveys a broader range of activities related to storing, holding, moving, transporting, or concealing dangerous drugs or controlled substances. During the clause-by-clause -clause consideration, the Chief Whip of the Senate, Ali Ndome, proposed an amendment calling for more stringent penalty to drug peddlers. Heroin or similar drugs, any person who without lawful authority A, imports, manufactures, produces, processes, plants or grows the drugs popularly known as cocaine, LCD, heroin or any other similar drug shall be guilty of an offense and liable on conviction to be to imprisonment for life. That is the original one. So since we want to amend this law to be more effective, then the punishment should be harder. So I am proposing that instead of imprisonment for life, it should be to be sentenced to death. I want to support completely the submission of the chief whip uh, in the sense that uh, it is time to call a spade a spade. If we want to eradicate drug trafficking in Nigeria, the only way to do that is to nip it from the board and to make it a capital offense. The matter was put on vote twice by the presiding officer, Baruaj Brain. <laughs> This sentence is not a matter for A, nay, or nay. Everybody should vote so that we will be counted. When it matters, those who vote for death and those who vote for punishment. I No, no, you cannot. We we'll take a vote. It's a, it's a fundamental issue. We are making law here. This is not a motion. I have responsibility for any law that I made while I'm in this parliament. No, we can't pass it because I don't believe that the nays, the highs have it. It's about life and death. Efforts by some senators to take a second look at the clause was rejected by the deputy president of the Senate, saying the governor had already gone on the matter and there is no way the Senate will return to it. Best Orator reporting for BTV News.